and a woman charged with manslaughter and child neglect in the death of a four-year-old boy, James Reese Jr., is now out of jail while she awaits trial. The cause of the boy's death was found to be blunt force trauma and was ruled a homicide. News for Jack's reporter Bree Isom joins us live. Bree, you spoke with the four-year-old's mother today. I did it. She said that she got a notification through the Vine system that Michelle Skippo bonded out on Friday. Now she believes that she should have never bonded out, and here's why. Marissa Garcia is the mother of James Reese Jr., the four-year-old boy who died in April after a doctor says he was thrown in a tub and hit with a belt. The cause of his death was blunt force trauma, and it was ruled a homicide. At the time of his death, Garcia said she did not have custody of her children because she was a victim of domestic violence. Michelle Sipko, the boy's foster mother and Garcia's cousin, was charged with manslaughter and child neglect in James's death. Her bond was originally set at $750,000 for each charge, but this week it was reduced to a total of $325,000. I wish there was no bond, especially when you either hurt a child or cute or child. Sipko's lawyer says in this court document that she has no criminal history and isn't a threat to the public, but Garcia disagrees. And Garcia is disappointed in her family. I didn't think my own flesh and blood would hurt one of my kids. Garcia's brother, Christopher Nastasi, says he's learned things that make him not trust Sipko. The nine-year-old, the oldest sibling, had enough sense to know her brother was in enough pain. And Michelle's reply to her was, we don't call 911 in this household. According to the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office's booking page, her location is HD1, which is home detention. 30-year-old Alex Pino, the boy's foster father, has been charged with second-degree murder and child abuse. He's being held without bond as he awaits his trial. A pretrial hearing for Pino's case is set to be held on July 21st. Reporting live, I'm Bree Isom, Channel 4, The Local Station.